Wow, you y'all are really close. Hold on. I still don't know how to YouTube apparently. This looks crooked. Unless it's just my books. I don't know. Greetings, salutations, Eddie here. Welcome back to my channel. And today I'm going to be doing something a little, something a whole lot lighter than my previous video, and that is, let's react. I'm doing my let's react again, and this is going to be a let's react to a lot of novels today, but primarily one I'm going to showcase because I'm actually really excited for this one. But then the rest I will show the cover and I will react, um, and I'll put all the books, um, Goodreads, um, pages down below for you guys to read. The first one I'm going to be reacting to is a cover reveal that just dropped today, and that is Ace of Spades by Farida Abike Yedmide. I hope I said her name right. I'm so sorry, Farida. I'm so sorry. Um, and um, the cover art is by Adelek Hadkonal, and the book design is by Elizabeth H. Clark. Um, and this will be published June 1st, 2021. So before I reveal the cover, I'll, I'll read the plot. Welcome to Nevius Academy, where money paves the hallways and the students are never less than perfect. Devin and Chiamaka are entering their senior year with everything ahead of them, the only black students in the school. Both perfects, both designed for top colleges. But the illusion of perfection is shattered when an anonymous texter starts spreading unpleasant rumors about the two of them. At first glance, it's nothing more than a prank. But as they invest it, as Devin and Chiamaka investigate, they find themselves at the center of a disturbing and deadly game, one with the potential to destroy every aspect of their lives. But how can they win the game when the cards are stacked against them? Gossip Girl meets Get Out and Ace of Spades, a high-octane YA thriller that serves as a blistering exploration of the barriers that young people of color face when they aspire to things that are easily that come easily to their white classmates. The cover. Stand over here. And by the way, you're going to hear the traffic, I'm sorry. Cover. I love this cover. I do. I think this cover is absolutely spectacular. I just love the red diamonds. And I love the masks. I love that the masks have, like, the one side is, like, um, darker and it's, like, sad. But then the other one is, is white with a smile. And I love the tagline. I love that the tagline is on this side of the book. How do you stop an unknown enemy and I love how the characters look as well I love the girl's hair I think it looks absolutely amazing and I love the and I, I and the skin tone for both of them look absolutely spectacular I'm excited for this novel I cannot wait to get into it I'm gonna be honest I thought this was a, a fantasy because sometimes when I hear Ace of Spades I think of like fantasy or even supernatural but this just sounds like a just a regular mystery thriller and and if it's anything like Gossip Girl, Gossip Girl and Get Out, I'm gonna watch it. Even though I'm, I was not a fan of Get Out, I kind of like Gossip Girl, so I'm gonna read this. Like I said, the book comes out um, June 1st, 2021. Also put the pre-order link down below for you guys to purchase as well. So this cover is a 5 out of 5. I think it's spectacular. Okay, so now we have a bunch of Penguin Teen book reveals. Uh, we, have, we have five more book reveals from um, Penguin Teen. And the first one is From Little Tokyo with Love by Sarah Kuhn, who is the author of I Love You So Much. And I love the color scheme of this cover. I think it's absolutely amazing. I love just the art the, and, and the simple font as well. I love it. Next is one that I'm absolutely excited for, and that's Lish McBride's Curses, which is a gender-flipped um, Beauty and the Beast. And I see Marissa Meyer's cover quote that says, The Beauty and the Beast retelling I've been waiting for. I'm excited. I cannot wait to read this book, and um, I'll put the and I'll put the release dates of each book down on the screen. Um, what is this one called? Okay, Living Beyond Borders: Growing Up Mexican in America, and it's a bunch of different authors going around the title. So I'm not gonna say all of them because because there's quite a bit. But it's edited by Margarita Longoria, and I think I like the cover. I I do. I I like the different colors. I like the I like that we just have one person at the top corner, um, and I feel like this would be a really interesting story to read. I feel like this is going to be a nonfiction book. I had that feeling, but I could be completely wrong. The Summer of Lost Letters by Hannah Reynolds. Um, this one sounds like a sad book just by the title and the cover. You know, it's just like this couple sitting on a beach, um, and like torn pieces of paper in the air. Um, this looks like a sad book. But 
the palettes, the color palettes are amazing. Um, and I'm guessing this is a contemporary. Then the last one just sounds like a hell of a time, and that is Eat Your Heart Out by Kelly Devos. It looks like a monster slaying novel, and you know what? I'm here for it. And it looks like we're going to have a plus size hero, so I'm even more down for that. So that's going to be it for my Let's React uh, cover reveals. If you guys enjoyed this video, please let me know what you thought of each book down below. Which one are you most excited for that I mentioned in this video? If you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up and comment your thoughts down below. And subscribe for more content. I hope you guys are staying safe and healthy, and I hope you're wearing a mask. Godspeed, God bless, and I will see everyone soon in my next video. Have a good day.